Hey y'all, and welcome to my channel. I'm Amy Lou. Today I am doing a kitchen cleanup and a small grocery haul. I, I had a busy morning this particular day. I went to a Pilates class and then I had to stop by the grocery store because we were having friends over for dinner and it was, my kitchen was a mess and I just needed to get in there and clean everything up and clean out my fridge and put groceries away. I bought a brisket to make for supper and I did not want to turn my oven on because it was so hot so I wanted to put it in my slow cooker and I put a slow cooker liner in there. Those things are a lifesaver. You should really get some. It's minimal cleanup so it's very little mess afterwards. But I just I poke holes in, in the brisket and I throw some marinade on top and that's about it. like using Claude's barbecue brisket marinade that was what that was it's really good adds a really nice flavor to the brisket and you honestly don't need anything else and I just wanted to show y'all that I was drinking coffee out of my queen mug My kitchen was a complete mess this day. I, I don't even know how I let it get that bad, but I guess I did. Doing a little shimmy there for you and finally putting away my groceries. We got 
some eggs, cold brew coffee, ranch dressing, some pepperoni, uh, romaine lettuce, some foil, Brussels sprouts, French green beans, avocado, cucumber, uh, purple onion, some Tillamook cheese, which is my very favorite, bacon, bacon at jalapenos, we also got some baking potatoes, and some spinach, pecan halves, and pickles, and a box of suddenly pasta or suddenly salad? Oh, suddenly salad. Paper plates and crystal light, and that's about it. My refrigerator needed to be cleaned out really bad, so I should start doing that, getting rid of things that are expired, things that we don't use, things that we shouldn't eat. You know, you know how it goes with the refrigerator clean out. I was also listening to some Bon Jovi, so that was why I was in the mood to, to move a little. Does anybody else cringe when you find things in there and you're like, oh lord, how long has that been sitting there? You guys, I don't know why that refrigerator door doesn't ever want to just stay open. I have to hold it the whole time. If you have any tips on how to keep it open, you guys let me know. Now I'm washing all the dishes that came from the refrigerator clean out, which I should have done the refrigerator clean out first and then all the dishes, but oh well. I prefer using Palmolive uh, dishwasher detergent over anything else. It seems like everything else I've tried leaves a, a really thick film on the dishes and I just don't like that. Now it's time to clean my sink with Barkeeper's Friend. It's my favorite stuff to use. And I get so much satisfaction from cleaning my sink. It's very therapeutic and I just, I love it. I love, the, I love seeing, seeing it afterwards when it's shiny and clean and
like cleaning with paper towels because I feel it doesn't leave a lot of lint behind and that, that kind of stuff drives me crazy. But what do you guys like to use? What do you prefer to, to clean your countertops with? Here's the best stuff in the world. <laughs> okay, I had it backwards. It's the Method Kitchen Cleaner from Target in Honeycrisp Apple. It smells really nice. And I thought I was finishing up, but then I turned and I saw how dirty the refrigerator was, so I had to clean that. And you guys know that I love the Sprayway World's Best Glass Cleaner, and I also like the Sprayway Stainless Steel Cleaner. I, just, I love their products, they're really good. Hey, and y'all remind me not to wear my hair like that again. <laughs> it's not very flattering, is it? I also like buffing it out with an old sock. It seems to work really well and I can bend my hand and stick my fingers up in the small spaces. And Okay you guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you like it. Please leave me any comments, suggestions, or any ideas for new videos. See y'all next time.